Hi, this is Dr. Clyde. I'm up at Mount Charleston, and I'm surrounded by all this pure water in the form of snow and ice. And it got me to thinking about the needs that we have for water. How much water do we actually need in the day? It's about a liter for every thousand calories that we eat. The reason is because as the food breaks apart into millions of little particles, each little particle needs a bunch of water to dissolve it, transport it into the bloodstream, so they can go to all the cells throughout our body. So if you just drink water with your meals, the excess water that you take in will go straight to your bladder and you'll dehydrate over the next couple hours while you're digesting food. So it's fine to drink water wa or drink anything with your meals. Best to go with water rather than something with calories since you're already eating calories. But you need to drink water in between meals. What are some of the other fluids that we take in? Milk, soda, fruit juice, all these things have about 100 calories per 8 ounce cup. So they only hydrate you about half as much as water does. So you would need about 2,000 calories of all these fluids to hydrate all the food that you're eating in a regular 2,000 calorie day. And coffee and tea is a weak diuretic, so anything more than two cups is going to start to dehydrate you, and anything over 2% alcohol is going to dehydrate you. So a glass of wine each evening, a little bit of green tea, a cup of coffee, fine, no problem, very healthy, all the phytonutrients, like in wine is resveratrol, but you don't want to do overdo any of these things. So here's Clyde's tips for fluid intake. Getting your fluid, your water, beautiful water, H2 O into your body. Drink at least as much water as everything else. And if you're thirsty, drink a little bit of water first. Then sip on and enjoy whatever it is that has that taste that you're looking for. We need this for all those little molecules that are floating around. Not just for digestion, but for thought, for signaling, everything. That's Clyde's thought for the day. I'll see you next time.